Okay, so... I streamed the other shitty Zelda game two weeks ago. This is Wand of Gamelon. Now, normally you play as Zelda in this game. But... Oof, that resolution. Um, but this time, I may have... I don't know, a special surprise? There's the team. They brought us so many classic games over the years, like Zelda, The Wand of Gamelon, and Link, The Faces of Evil. And a third title that's even worse than both of these that will never be remastered. Vinny, don't you always play Zelda, says the chat member. Always. It's the only content on this channel. That's why I'm going to play this super good game called Zelda The Wand of Gamelon. Zelda, Duke Onklet is under attack by the evil forces of Ganon. I'm going to Gamelon to aid him. <laughs> but father, what if something happens to you? I'll take the Triforce of Courage to protect me. If you don't hear from me in a month, send Link. Ampa? A full don't month. Don't worry, Zelda. The Triforce of Wisdom promises the king will safely return. Enough. My ship sails in the morning. I wonder what's for dinner. <laughs> oh boy! I'm so hungry, I could eat an Octorok! I wonder what's... A whole month gone, and still no word. I'm certain he's alright. Yeah, that old Ganon's no match for the king. Link, go to Gamelon and find my father. Great! I can't wait to bomb some Dodongo! <laughs> I hate him so much! Wake up, Impa. We're going to Gamelon. Alright, dear. I'll get the Triforce of Wisdom. Vomit, now! Alright, dear. I'll grab the Triforce, the most... Uh, the most valuable item in all the land. Are we in Dugunk? right now chat it's hard to know which area oh oh uh this is the surprise chat he's so hungry and he can't wait for dinner so he's just gonna fucking crack some skulls cause i'm on your side but i still have to sell the stuff just pick what you want i'll handle the rubies Rupee. There we go. Got some good items. Good, good items. I just got rope. That's it. Never mind. Good item. Oh fuck! Wasted rope. Sorry, Zelda. Not enough <laughs> rubies. You'll have to wipe out a few more gorillas to get that. Uh, yeah, no, I'm- this is not Zelda. Cause I- Please leave! King, leave! So, if you didn't watch my Link Faces of Evil stream, this is the remastered edition. I would recommend watching the actual, like, original version to see how terribly it runs and see how bad the hitboxes are. And you have limited lives in the, uh, original versions. This is much more playable. I was actually able to play Faces of Evil, and I didn't completely hate it. But these are not good games. Um, these are, these are pretty historically... Oof. Vinny subtitles. Excuse me, you expect subtitles for this? How- <laughs> why would there be subtitles? There were? Wait, what? Are you serious? There were subtitles last stream? Wait, how do I go back to the main menu?
star. I think I have to reset. I completely forgot there were subtitles. I just assumed... That's all it takes is two weeks to forget a minor detail like that, but I just assumed that we had to live with the fact that there were none. But I want to know, with the subtitle, I want to know how Dugonklit is spelled. Options. Oh yeah, wow. I guess we'll just go here. 40 to 50 feral hogs. As king, I must punch all of them. Oh, and I have karate kick too. Fuck. D U G O N Gong Ong Tlit Du Is playing as the king something the modder added? I think so. I don't believe King was actually in this game originally. Not even as an unlockable. But in order to get King, you have to defeat Hero Mode. And Hero Mode is like a fucking nightmare, so... Um... Someone sent me their save file, and they were like, Here, if you want to play as the king, this is how you do it. I got it. I was like, chat member, you are invaluable. Everyone ran when the Gleok came, but monsters know better than bothering me. Here's a shroud that scares the raps off Gibdo. All right. Well, we're still going to see Zelda in the cutscenes, which which I'm Every I'm actually kind of okay with because it makes this whole experience a whole lot more surreal. Is that Impa? Oh my! It looks like everyone's been taken to Taikogi Tower. This is illegal, you know. <laughs> my cakes will burn. <laughs> Where are these people coming from? I don't see anyone else, just Impa. Walking back and forth and avoiding pterodactyls narrowly. They're in the Triforce of Wisdom. Oh, right, right, right. I see. This is illegal, you know. I love this animation. By the way, the king has better animations than both Link and Zelda. Oh, I don't have any bombs. Bombs? Kinda wish our boy was in this game. Uh, uh what's his name? Gro uh, Gro Rogu. Glup Shitto. No, what's it? Uh, you know, our boy. Morshoe. Just, oh no, I, I didn't forget his name. It was a bit. It was. It was definitely a bit. Where's my, um, how come I can't use, oh, I need, like, the thing to use the oil. I can't use it yet. Fuck's sake. I mean, sure, there were some dinosaurs in Zelda history, but there's just a lot of dinosaurs in these two games. Uh, whose skull is that, dude? So, all right. I don't know what this character is going to look like, because I've only played this for like five minutes. 
I don't know, like in the past, I don't know what this character's gonna look like, but take a look at their sprite here. They have no shoes or feet, by the way. None. Um, just pickles where their legs used to be. It's bug snacks, but let's see what it looks like here. Hello, dearie. I oh, just a didn't expect that. <laughs> Isn't it lovely? Bring some fairy dust and I'll make it a magic cloak. Okay, can you- can you stop? <laughs> ho! Ho! Ha! It's the one thing missing from this game, is... Just a little bit of, like... King voice acting for every attack. Oh! More crusty moblins. They just look like swole people with dog faces. Again, I think they're basing these moblin designs off the fucking cartoon from the 80s. I, I love the perspective. Like, what what's happening? What is the king walking on? They do look like Morn from Deep Space Nine, you're not wrong. Guy never shuts up. Nice kick. Lantern. Ha! You know, these games actually do have pretty decent music. Not always fitting music, but effort is here. Maybe the other game more than this one, but yeah, that's my opinion. CDI Tetris has some bangers. I believe it. Maybe they were like, hey, we want to show off our CD technology, so we need some decent music. What about a good game? No. No, we don't need- we don't need that. Just- just the music. Oh! Intimidating enemy. Tronic. Like, Whistle-tronic. It's a very interesting genre mashup here. One thing it is not is Zelda music. What if CDI King and King Rome fuse together? None more powerful an entity would ever, uh, would ever exist. I almost said that right. Sorry, I just wanted to punch a hog. Vinny forgot to use key. Oh, you have to use it here, you're- yeah. Forgot about that. Again, look at the character here, and then wait for it and try to imagine what this character looks like in the cutscene. Alright, you got it? Good. Again, unexpected. Um, at least the art looked similar. Such a weird style of gameplay. Where, like, you have to get to the exit of one stage and then it just brings you to another spot on the map for you to go into. Just... odd. I love seeing the king punch these fucking tektites. Or Goma, sorry, Goma. I don't know why... I, yeah, why but Goma has just become crab. 
Like your your average everyday crab and tektite would be the proper enemy to have here because the tektite you actually end up seeing a lot more and and goma is just a one-time enemy. Nice jump over the goma pit. Here, have a drink. Thanks. Okay, we don't need hey, to see your face that close. Hey, there's trapped in the fish head. Really? <laughs> I can can someone nice. take a screenshot Jump of Zelda's face pit. when she Here, says, really? Thanks. It's so vacant. Hey, there's a fisherman trapped in the fish head. Really? It's- <laughs> They're going- The eyes! Oh god, the art is so incredible. It's so good. Vinny, that's already a meme. How could- how could it not be? Every frame in this game is probably- You know- you know the- the YouTube channel, Every Frame a Painting? This is every frame a meme. New emote? Wouldn't be opposed to it. Why does this rock not... Each boulder needs 10 bombs. This game can choke on some... lamp oil. Uh, yeah, usually, I guess the power glove would make a suitable replacement, but if you're saying it needs 10 bombs, then sure. Wouldn't it be super cool if, like, every Zelda game, you had to bomb... You had to use 10 bombs per thing? That would be fun. I need the store. Love that animation. We have enough rubies. He just looks like an eager shopper. Nobody ever suggests it needs that much in the game, ever. So you just have to figure out, like, so, okay, you're, you're a kid playing this, you poor bastard. I'm so sorry that you got a CDI instead of a Sony PlayStation or anything else, really. But, you're a kid, you're playing this, you get to the part where there's a boulder and you use your bombs and you're like, well, I used five of them. Better yet, I've used nine bombs and, and it hasn't done anything, so clearly that's not the solution. What I need to do is find another item. And remember, the actual CDI version of this game runs really slow. That is so dumb. That is so dumb. Thanks. You saved me. Kill it. It's the last time I'm going fishing. See you in Cicado. Chateau Lake. Oh, 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 dinner. Oh. I want to see Har King Harkinian's Hyrule Warriors moves. Is it just me, or is the art style of this one particular hut different than most of the rest of the game so far? This is like colored pencil, but this is more detailed colored pencil. Yo, the king is kind of thick though. <laughs> oh god, whoever made this asset knew exactly what they were doing. You, how dare you? All this dinner goes straight to my bum. That's awesome, King! Oh 
dear. Wizrobe has captured Lady Alma. I'm not afraid of you. No. Ha! Then wait here until you are. I'm sorry? Oh dear. Wizrobe. And that means what? Oh, it means go through this door. Oh, it means dark. So remember, I've seen a lot of this game through YouTube poops and such, but not all of it. Like, I've never seen that cutscene, for example. So a lot of this is, like, new to me for the very first time, and I just did not have the patience to play this before it was remastered. Again, it runs better if you're just joining. This is the remastered version. It runs faster. The hitboxes are better, and the live the life system is gone, so you can continue infinite. Doesn't exactly make the games good, but it makes them much more tolerable. When I say um, good, a couple things that would help would be a more like I don't know cohesive world map. Um, maybe just more interesting gameplay than just punch or, or use sword over and over and over again. And then the other thing would be a final boss that doesn't die in one hit. Iframes would, would certainly help, sure. Endlessly respawning enemies. <laughs> I, I guess this doesn't work. Collect his spells. Alright, well, we're not ready yet for that. Someone said, stand still. Okay, next. Wait, 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 wait. What, what's here? I feel like... Okay, no, no, this is new. I still need to be here. I have to just use another 10 bombs probably, but yeah, this is good. This might take longer. Jesus. Come on, hurry! It's awful! Mayor Cravendish has been chained in the tower! Oh my cakes! Come see me in Cicado! Oh, my cakes! Hey, I have you seen my cakes? These are just enemies? I, I guess they're just shitty wall masters? Vinny, do you plan on streaming Super Rubber Ross World? His Mario Maker levels. Uh, I plan on doing at least one stream of them. He did 40 levels, and knowing Ross's levels, they're going to be very difficult. And 
I will get through as many as I can. Yeah, there's there's some, you know, CBT in there. So yeah, I'll, I'll do it. I'll stream it once. stop. That's very you good. Dare defy me? Oh no. You will die. Guess again, Iron Knuckle. I don't think I have the ability to defeat Iron Knuckle. Iron Chuckle fuck. Well, I don't have the, uh, iron, uh, well, the power glove, so that's not happening. Kill Gibdo at Sakado. It's a good thing I know what those words mean. Otherwise, I'd probably have you rushed off in an ambulance. Darmok and Jalad at Tanagra. Gibdo in Sakada. Gibdo and Harkinian in Sakada. Sorry, Zil. Your friend Link could eat ten of these. <laughs> At least. Ha! The Arpagos will die for them. Good cutscene. Your friend. Oh, oh, now I have bread that can be used to destroy an enemy, I guess. Uh, maybe that's what I got from that, at least. So there's a Gibdo in this town? Maybe in that building that was, like, dark? Vinny, go through the window? What? What do you mean, go through the window? Oh, come on. Fuck off. Do you see anything? Yes? Oh my, your father has been captured. Look at Zelda's mouth, what is she doing with her mouth? He's been in a terrible fight. I can't tell what happened. Oh, I'm here. This is like that Star Trek episode. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry, but it's like that, that episode where they're different people, but they play themselves in Deep Space Nine. Like, they see each other as themselves, but they are different people. Do you see anything? Look yes? at Zelda's lips. Oh, it's just my. one red line. Now, look, she opens her mouth. Captured. It's weird. What is that? What Why? Link? He's been in a... It's so strange. Vinny, the eyes at the end. What do you mean, the eyes at the end? Do you see anything? Yes? Oh my, your father has been captured. What about Link? He's been in a terrible fight. I can't tell what happened. The, the whole, like, Zelda's face is just wrong in this game. I saw it, like, they get droop, drippy droopy, and I don't understand, like, how they didn't stop this. Anything of import? Oh yes. My favorite type of room in these Zelda games from the CDI. Climb tower while endless pterodactyls try to kill you.
Someone in chat mentioned Zelda's contempt for Link. This is a weird trope that was happening, I guess, a lot in the 80s, but yeah, the cartoon show was just all Zelda having contempt for Link, but Link was kind of contemptible. <laughs> he was just, like, annoying. He was, like, always horny at the most inappropriate times. Hey, we were just captured by Ganon! How about a kiss, Zelda? Look, I got a new job. Flexing. Hey, bring a heat crystal. I'll fix up your sword. S sword? Look, I got a new job. Hey. <laughs> I just am so... I'm just chuffed that the source material for this game was mostly the Zelda cartoon show from the 80s. That is wonderful. That is so incredibly tone-deaf for the entire series. Yeah, we need graveyard music. Well, I've got my Yamaha. And, uh... Do you want some sick drum fills with gated reverb? Yes, we do, in fact. Yeah, we would like that a lot. For the dead shall rise, and the living shall be their slaves. She must be stopped. For the dead shall rise. And I am the shock master. I see skies of blue. Now, as you know, the fisheye is worth at least 10 points. forget that you need to use rope in this game, and it's just not always obvious. I mean, it is, but I'm, I'm dumb. I am officially out of lamp oil, but that's okay. I just need to kill Gibdo and then... This round, no, it's gone. Ah! It's just an everyday like, household blanket. Well, that item is now just useless and sitting in my inventory for no good reason. More fun with perspective. The music kind of reminds me of, like, you know, LSD Dream Emulator? Maybe, like, something similar to that, where each scene has its own music. It kind of reminds me of something like, you'd hear this song in, in one scene, and then it would skip to another one, and then another one, and then another one. This kind of reminds me of music like that. Like, very specific incidental music for a fucking trip game. There we go. Fuck! <sighs> I 
<sighs> Not that bad. Hell, this might even make a good speed run. <laughs> Not this particular one, but this game, like this and Faces of Evil together, the remastered editions, would probably be a fun speedrun to watch. Hmm. Oh, fun. Aren't you a might puny to go up against Ganon? I'll do all right. That's the spirit. Bring some hand you spore if you want a bit more punch. Hmm. And now my favorite part. It's let's find the area that we have to go to. Oh right, someone needed an egg. Your friend Link Lovely. Bring some f Please go chat. Oh God, it's so dumb. You don't want the egg. Egg was the girl in that whistling place. That was like two years ago. I don't remember who that was. Locked house in Kobitan. It's a speedrun tactic. Oh, this is the whistling place. You're right, that's correct. What? Explain! <laughs> Give egg, make omelet, get flute, immediate blow into flute. Thanks, leave. Um... Good. What well, stops enemies? At least some of them. Vinny, I made the Zelda emote. Then here's a walkthrough. That's gonna be a reverb fart, isn't it? Fuck it. <laughs> That's pretty good. I'll consider it. We've already got Link, so... We've got Link and Morshu. Oh my, it looks like everyone's been taken to Taikogi Tower. This is illegal, you know. My cake. Mm. 
All right. Um, now I have to think about what makes sense for the next move. God damn it. Uh, any ideas? Like, I can't believe I'm asking chat about Zelda CDI, but... There's a dark house in Sakato you haven't explored. I think I did. I guess not. Oh, power sword. What, what's a power sword doing in someone's attic? Just randomly. No, um... Oh, this is new. More classic Zelda enemies. Fucked up pterodactyls with broken necks. And these things. Like Blue Met from Mega Man? Fuck. Or just slimes from Zelda 2. But done really weird. Oh, fuck! Oh! <laughs> They're more Dark Helmet than Darth Vader. Also considering I unlocked... Oh, I don't want to spoil any character unlocks for Hyrule Warriors, but... This is especially appropriate to stream today, in my opinion. Nay... Nay you... Spore? Princess Zelda, do you have any Arpagos feathers? Did you, I'm sorry, did you just do a flip? Did Zelda... Greetings, uh, Princess whoa, Zelda. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you have any Arpagos feathers? So, Greetings, Princess look Zelda. at the camera angle. Do you have any Arpagos feathers? Also, there's like a very disturbing shot in there. At least one frame was disturbing. But to me, that looked like Zelda was, like... We have frozen the fountain of life. Oh, that was good. We have made evil. Let's bring the darkness down. Okay. What I was trying to say was the camera was just, like, elevated. That's all. All right. Well, rest in peace. Ho! Oh! All our lovely evil ruined now! Ah! Wow, what a tough fight. We're free. You saved us. Here's a life heart and some fairy dust. Have some water of life. Note, they're about half the size of the king here. Oh, what is this one doing? <laughs> oh no! Have some water of life. But now they're like the size of a hand. 
And they have different hair colors, too. They didn't even get the hair color colors close to right. It's red and, like, teal. And here it's orange and brown. Oh! Huh? I saw the new area. Blonde is orange. What? Oh, good. There. Now you I wasn't a color major in, in a college. Monster. Good shot before he sees you. And just like that, she's gone. Also, that clap was from the Yamaha keyboard. <laughs> Did you not go to elementary school? No, I went straight to high school and then college. So, alright. Um, I have the thing that can defeat one of the things. And I have a new area to go to. Oh, I hate the Zoras in this game. They're so fucking bad. What's that? You accidentally jumped? Sorry, gotta wait. that's an alligator I don't know if those are supposed to be Zoras the the other ones they, they're so weird looking oh fuck off that like look at its face why does it have boobs it's just not necessary for this game Wow, this is a shitload of fuck. What were they thinking? Someone said, shitload of fuck, new favorite phrase. This is a new phrase. I have invented shitload of fuck just now, tonight. No, the world has not heard this phrase. I, I shall thenceforth be known as the angry video game nerd. I, I stole that phrase from angry video game nerd chat member. You might like his videos if you like that word. He, he makes other good words too. Well, I, sentence, phrase. This is a cool game. Vinny, just jump off the cliff. Just jump off the cliff, they said. Is this a... Is this a fucking joke?
Not enough rupees to use a flute that's in my inventory that I have. Fuck you, game! Oh, The backgrounds in this game suck so much ass! I am becoming James Rolfe. Oh, oh god. That's what these games will do to you. Play enough shitty games, you evolve into <laughs> Buffalo Diarrhea Ass Man. I just took a lucky guess there. Little Donkey Kong Country 2 action. I do not like watching the king climb those ropes. Wildly uncomfortable. Reflecting shield. Okay. See, now we're making good progress. Progress. There's a clip of David Hayter going around today. It was like, Who's my little pog champ? I mean, dude's getting paid for it. That was a meal, a full meal for him and his family at Friendly's. The stream not brought to you by Friendly's. And you don't have the power glove. This is not the right way. Swamp the power glove. Oh. Nine. I'm looking. Where is the clip? Uh, fine, I guess you are my little pog champ. That's not David Hayter, but yeah, the same, same sentiment, chat. Same sentiment. Just picture it in his voice. Just remember, if you ever start your own stream, just don't click strange YouTube links in chat. Wait, 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 I think we got it. Hang on. Chat wanted to see it, and I want to see it too. Hang on. Here it is. There's an extra bit where he screws up, and then he does like a double... <sighs> that I really like. 
So I think it's it's worth seeing. Let's let's take a look at this. Here's the pool that Solid Snake built. Pre, this is Solid Snake. Irina wanted me to send you this message by Kodak. I don't understand it, but here it is. Yeah, fine. I guess you are my little pod champ. <laughs> Come here. Uh, fine. I guess you are my little cup. Uh, <laughs> I guess you are my little pod champ. Come here. Like he either got the line wrong or he's showing his true disgust. I guess you are my little cup. Ugh. Ugh. Fine. Ugh. Ugh. This music. Oh yeah, no, I've seen the one where David Hayter says, Vinny, I need you to squeeze my hog. Definitely have seen that one. You're back! Now give me your glove! Hey! <laughs> Don't worry! Here! A power glove! Great! Hmm! Aren't you a might puny? We've already done this. Hmm! Aren't you a might puny to go up against Ganon? I'll do all right. Oh. In a weird way, I think David Hayter sounds better doing Snake these days than like the last couple years he was doing Snake because he would prepare by smoking and drinking whiskey and it got so gruff. But now when he does it, it sounds much more like Metal Gear Solid 1 and 2 Snake, which I like a lot better. Not to say he did a bad job ever. I always thought he did a good job, but by the time you hit Peace Walker, he's just like... <laughs> I'm in the facility, huh? What, what do you mean, nuclear weapons? I give you the power drive, you take the converter, you give me any... You dare defy me? You will die. Get Peace Walker stream knuckle. when? I already did. Dead. Let's get out of here. Whoa, Iron Knuckles have, like, meat hearts in the middle of them. Confirmed. I still don't understand how they could get away with, like, thinking that a one-hit kill boss was a, a good idea. I mean, I'm, I'm fine with it because it means that um, I have to play this game less. But still. And yes, the king ate the heart to get the extra health. Oh, the indignity. Please, your highness, would you kindly cut the chains that bind me? Oh, the indig... Ouch! <laughs> Thank you, princess. I managed to conceal this magic lantern. I hope it can be of use. Thanks. Where'd you put it? Where was it? <laughs> uh -oh. <gasps> uh -oh. 
It was in his door dung cave. Also, door dung cave? Aren't these Dodongos? Even though they're just Triceratops. Chat saying this is reminding them of Splatoon music. I hear it. I hear it a little bit. Fun. My favorite instrument in this song is when they break a chandelier. so the flute doesn't work here. That would have been the one item that would have really helped with this. Could you imagine the exercise and torture this was on the original platform? Oh, just thinking about it. A frightful prospect. I'm assuming this uses rupees. Doesn't matter. Heat crystal. Where do I bring that? For anyone who doesn't know, this was the original controller, says a chat member. Yeah, let's take a look at the original controller. Wouldn't you have loved to play a platforming side-scroller game with this? Well, just think of it like this. You could hold it... Um, well, you could turn it sideways, and you could press the stop button to stop the game. And then you're done. Let's see. That ought to do it. <laughs> Works pretty good. Massive explosion. Works pretty good. Flex. I got a new job. You didn't fully flex. What the fuck? That was close to a limbo of the lost voice. It really was. I don't need to do anything else here, right? Forest and lake still have stuff. We'll take the shortcut. Oh yeah, Impa does give advice. Oh! 
Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Hello, I'm playing King Harkinian in the new Zelda movie. And Robin Williams was a Zelda fan. I mean, he named his daughter Zelda. Could you imagine how terrible that would have been? If after the Mario movie, they went straight into production of a Zelda movie, and they based it on this and the cartoon, and they had Robin Williams play the king. Okay, that actually kind of would have been cool in a way, just to see it. But that would have been like, that would have been a really bad movie. Like a really bad movie. I kind of want to go to an alternate dimension where it happened, though. Just for a minute. Heading out. Is that dress a little too much? Link told me about you. You know Link? Sure. Uh, he gave me his canteen for a kiss. Oh my god. You kissed him? Here. It's empty anyway. Oh, that was a stank face. So much development. Link is a bit of a himbo. Gonna go to the forest? Okay. My brain just does not absorb these games. Like, I'm already bad with directions in games anyway, mostly. Like, when I'm streaming especially, because I can just take- I can put the training wheels on, because I know chat is there. And that's like a bad habit that I've gotten into over the years, but... There's something extra crusty about this game, where I just don't remember where anything is. All of it just blends into one great big smear. That would have been my review of the game. All of it just blends into one big smear. You can put that on the back of the box. Greetings, Princess Zelda. Do you have any Arpagos feathers? <laughs> Good. Then let us make a cape from your shroud. Do a, do a flip. Here, I must be off. Never to be seen again. Fly now. Oh, it's more of a long jump. So, um, where else? Maybe the. Let's go here first. Considering the enemies aren't invisible. Look how your father was captured. I'm you right here. Are my prisoner. Hey! Silence! Hectan, keep the runt in chains. Yes, master. What does that have to do with the king being Look, captured? Your father was captured. You are my prisoner. Hey! Who is I that guy? Hectan, keep the runt in chains. Yes, master. 
That was Duke Onklet. Onklet. Duke Onkt Onktlet. I thought the name of the place was Duke Onktlet. Duke Onktlet. Duke. Duke Onktlet. What a confusing. Like, couldn't they have made it like slightly easier to say name? That wasn't Duke Onktlet. That's one guy. I don't care who who Duke Onktlet is. I really don't. It's fine. I don't. I don't need to know. Duke Ongt. That name is going to be a mind virus for me over the next couple days. I know how these things go. Hectan is dangerous. How'd you get here? Am I here or here or here? <laughs> next. <laughs> Okay. Thanks, Impa. Who has teleported. <laughs> Very good! Duke Onktlet is friends with Glup Shitto. It's true. If Glup Shitto sounds like an implausible name for the Star Wars universe, just remember there's a character called Kit Fisto. And then it doesn't seem so implausible anymore. Yeah, we're not doing Therm Scissor Punch or Elon Sleaze Bagano or any of that stuff. Like, we do this conversation a lot, and someone in chat will be like, Vinny, we've done this conversation just this week. And so, yeah, I don't want to even mention the name Elon Sleaze Bagano. It's really not worth it. But if you want to talk about my, my Bug Snack name that I made up when I was playing Bug Snacks, we can do that. Hot Dog Elon. <gasps> no, I missed it. I skipped the best scene. Fuck. Stream ruined. Cutscene. Got it. Wait, I've got it. Cutscene. You've killed me. Good. <laughs> also, is that James Rolfe at the beginning? Cutscene. You've killed me. Good. You've you've killed me and it, it... Why does everything dissolve except for his ass? I don't I don't know, dude. That was no, that was a heart. No.
Vinny, we need a vine good emote. Vinny, wrong way? Ugh. Oh. You'll forgive me if I didn't see the totally not obvious exit. I don't know what a vine good would be. Oh, come on. This king's gonna get his fat ass through this window? Duke Onclid betrayed the king. I know. Strike the head of the portrait to enter Onclid's chamber. Thanks. Onc Onclid. I was- I was told to show chat. And while that happened, I died and got kicked to the world map. I hope you're proud of yourself, chat member. This game has no honor. Okay, this is where I have to be anyway, so... You killed me! Good is my favorite Zelda quote from any game, says chat member. I think I can agree with that. I think I'm starting to just, like see the, the light of that reasoning because that is quite good. That's Duke Onk. Don't hurt me, Zelda. Gonk I'll tell you the secret way into Resong Palace. You better talk fast. Go all the way left and move the rock. This key opens the gate. I'll make sure he doesn't get away. I'm sorry, who are you again? And Zelda just threatened Duke Onkel's life with a fucking sword. But it looked more like a knife. Vinny, he's a traitor. He betrayed the king. Oh, who? Du Duke Onklet? Duke Onk. You betrayed the love! Ah, yes. Need to light my way with the lantern here in this outdoor forest area that is getting a full blast of sunlight. Yes, yes. Oh, it's you again. This light will penetrate the dark around Ganon, but only the wand can defeat him. Good luck! It is written, only the wand can defeat Ganon. I'm supposed to move a rock or something? Well, I can see invisible enemies now, so that's... new. Vinny, Shrine of Gamelon first. I'm just gonna tank these hits, because the king is girthy and made of stern stuff. Asset over here. Oh dear, 
Omfak is guarding the shrine. Whatever I see, I shall devour. What the fuck? Why did you turn it to lips? Mm. I don't understand. Oh dear, Omfak is guarding the shrine. Whatever I see, I shall devour. But you had a mouth on your previous form. You didn't need to turn into oops all lip. Chat, Mick Jagger does not need to be in this game. Also, that... That, like, Tibetan statue, I don't know what that is so far. If, if I got it wrong, I apologize. Why are there so many of these... Uh, for fuck's sake. Looks like Buddha. Fair enough. Yeah, that just feels like a picture that someone took and, like, someone just drew it into the game. But then again, the original Zelda did have, like, a crucifix. One and two, in fact. Zelda one and two. Probably just do this. Like, body those hits. You have like full health. Oh, uh, maybe this is based on that one boss from Zelda too. Oh yeah, he's hungry. Can I have my bread back? You fucking reprobate. Is that it? Is the bread just gone now forever? So nonsensical. It's such horse shit. The bread is only used to distract flying enemies? Well then. Ganon, but the Triforce says you can only win by falling. I wonder what that means. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know either, Impa, but those camera angles are really innovative. This game is the equivalent of Liam Neeson climbing a fence in Taken 3. Another attempt at a Zelda 2 enemy, I think. Oh shit, it's Fierce Head from Secret of Mana. Locked.
Oh, okay. Oh, that one drops the key. Good. Well, now you know how to get infinite money in Wand of Gamelon, chat. How many rupees do I have? 732. Even less things to buy them, uh, buy with them than usual Zelda games, too. Wonderful. I feel like at least 30% of the enemies in this game we're dripping water. That's an impressive design choice. This game looks like the green screen arcade kids had to go through in Nick Arcade. Yeah, that's right. Now, why don't we move Mikey on the board and see where he goes? Oh, Mikey can't go right. Try again. Oh, Mikey can't go up either. Nope, like I said, Mikey can't go right. He, he can't go... You gonna stop? Nope, Mikey can't go up or right. You can try any other direction. Many, many people will be very confused by this reference if you weren't born in ye olden days. But, um... It's worth watching. You can, like, probably just type Nick Arcade YouTube. If you like video games and classic video games and you've never seen Nick Arcade, it was a video game game show before video games kind of became mainstream from the early 90s, and it was just really weird. And, like, they had to beat high scores in an arcade, then they got put in a video game with green screen. You bring light to my lair? You must die! Die! Once again, one hit KO. You know what? Before I end this um, one of Gamelon stream, let's. Cool, now, now I can end it. Well, this is weird. Wait a minute. Yo, I didn't even consider that I'd be rescuing myself. Why is he so old? That's very... Seuss. It's a time prison? It's a Miles O'Brien time prison. Father! You've saved me! Here's the traitor, your majesty. Please, your omnipotence, have mercy! After you've scrubbed all the floors in Hyrule, then we can talk about mercy. Take him away. Yes, my liege. I wonder what happened to Link. Oh, he was a bore anyway. Stop looking at yourself. Oh. 
What happened? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing, Link. We were just about to have a feast. Great! <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> well, I can finally say I've completed both Wand of Gamelon and Faces of Evil. This will count for nothing in the short years that I have left on this planet. You know, could be 30, could be 40, could be 50, who knows? If I'm on a- listen, if I'm ever on a video game quiz show, I'll know how to answer the question. At the very least, I have knowledge now. When they reboot Nick Arcade with, um, what's his name? Ky Kylo, Ky um, uh, uh, Kilo, uh, Jeff Keeley. Then I could be on there and I can answer the questions. I'll win the prize. Oh, Mikey can't go right. You should try again. Vinny, quick pop quiz. What was the name of the first boss you beat in Wand of Gamelon? So anyway, thank you so much for watching this awful game. I really enjoyed playing it. Not really, but it was good for Sunday. If you want to see what Zelda looks like, I can show you for a second. And I can show you hero mode. Duke Anklet is under attack by the evil forces of Ganon. I'm going to Gamelon to aid him. Anklet. Do, do gongloom. So you can see the king had so much more expression and animation and life. Look at that stab. What, what form? Look at the form. Where she just like... Like does the hokey pokey with her foot. You know what she looks like to me? Did you ever see the Dark Crystal? Mmm, <laughs> Gelfling, good! Mmm, essence! Hero mode, you just take double damage, I think. So it's even more miserable an experience. Now picture this with lives and like even worse frame rates. And that controller that you saw earlier. And a CRT TV. Sure, why not? Throw that in there too. Vinny, I don't think the original had hero mode. If it didn't, then just add all that stuff that I said to the original game, and it's still painful. That walk animation is just so, like, wrong. It just doesn't convey much of any- This does not look like Zelda. Alright, well, anyway, there you go. I'm really happy that these exist. Oh, fuck, wrong image. Um, I'm really happy that- that this was something I could do. It was... entertaining. I laughed. And I got to see some cutscenes that I had never seen before. So... Yeah, I mean, I'm glad it happened. There's one more Zelda game for the CDI that I also believe I checked out briefly years ago. It's fucking terrible. And the problem with playing anything more CDI is that it's on the CDI. So like Hotel Mario... Yeah, there you go. Is not something I really need to do. Father! You saved me! 
people are posting YouTube poops now. Um, you know, there is definitely a chance that there's a chance I'm going to say that one day I would check out that other Zelda game in a little bit more detail and that I would also check out Hotel Mario. But you know what, chat, all of it is already on YouTube. I don't need to suffer through Hotel Mario just to get to the cutscenes. I could just play them in a YouTube video in sequential order and we would all have so much fun for like five minutes. And I already did play the Warcraft game that was made, um, the animations were made by the same company. It was pretty bad. So, all right. Anyway, everybody, thank you so much for watching this horrendous segment. I'll take a quick break for dinner and I'll be back with Space Oddities. <laughs>